All right, big country, follow me. We're headed to the new fire station. Watch out, we got deer on the road. All right, Garrett, don't hit any traffic. Follow me, keep your lights on. It's a very short drive. Today, we are going to a brand new fire station. It's gonna be really fun. So this map is called Waldstetten, and it's crazy. Garrett and I spent the last couple hours just flying around, like kind of just, oh, oh, watch out traffic. Just playing around on the map, trying to figure out where everything is. And it is, it is like a European looking map, but it's pretty crazy. There's a really awesome fire station that we're gonna show you, which is right here not too far of drive it comes with a police station what else garrett there's there's something else we i'm forgetting hospital yeah a full-fledged hospital with a helicopter pad working like, elevators oh yes i would have forgot about that working elevators like full hospital bedroom so really cool i think we're gonna run a bunch of videos out of here a bunch of series so make sure to subscribe hit the like button and just a shout out to so it's wald stetton w-a-l-d-s-t e t t e n if you look it up it's uh it's public right garrett yes it should be able to be found on mod network if you guys are looking to get it perfect and I, i'm probably pronouncing it the wrong way too but anyway if you guys are looking to get it like garrett said it is public here is the i guess parking garage or parking area for the fire station it's like a modern looking look at this co this corner right here this corner is really cool with the windows and stuff oh yeah this place is stunning brand new build that's for sure yeah, it's great. It's got the red, but it's not like, not the whole entire thing is red. It, you know, it's got the modern like brick. It's not like, you know, the, the red brick and stuff, but it's got the nice red walls and then some wood on the back here. Let's go inside before we get more trucks in here. All right, check this out. Heck yeah. High ceilings. When we bring the ladder truck in, ladder trucks in, we can actually like lift them up a little bit, make sure everything's working good. Yep. We have our little bay area over here so we can get changed and everything like that. One thing, Garrett and I were doing a little tour before this. Maybe we'll find it this time, but we have not been able to find a fireman's pole. That's true. We have no clue where that's located. If it's here or maybe because it's European, they don't have them. I true. don't know. True. Yeah. Who knows? So pretty much the main floor is just kind of office space, desk space, more like store. Yeah. Here's more desk space, more like storage or like, you know, just kind of empty rooms. And then we, you can even pull the fire alarm in here. Can't you, Garrett? Yes, you can. Most buildings on this map have fire alarms. Very good. All right, Pretty and cool. then upstairs is where the meat and potatoes are. Isn't that right, Garrett? Yes, sir. This place is so nice up here. I'm definitely going to spend most of my time sitting on these chairs. Yeah, hang out here in the lounge area and just look out and stuff. Watch the fire trucks roll in and out, ambulances, stuff like that. Here's more office space, bunch of cabinets. Yeah, more like office desks. Like we even got projectors in here that, you know, we have conferences or something. I try and convince the boss to buy me a new truck. Here's my bedroom. That's okay. That's yours. You call dibs on it. Oh yeah. Big TV. There's the map. This is a, um, this is just a browser page of it. So Waldstetten, my favorite cool. is this balcony oh, yeah. right here. You, I'm, I'll probably spend a lot of time up here. You can hang out here and then we'll, this is probably where we're going to wash all the trucks back in this, you know, area back here. I could jump up on the roof from the railing. There you Kinda go. Cool. Kind of feels like a restaurant up there too. I don't know. It does. Oh, we got to get some chairs up here. That's for sure. Heck yeah. And then let's look. We have some. Yep. That's Garrett's bedroom. Another conference room. And then this is where it all goes down. We can conference up here. And then we have dispatchers running from here with all the monitors and computers. That That's crazy. And guys, there's a projector that actually has like the projector like look coming out of it, like the light and everything. Yeah. 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 I didn't notice that. That's pretty, like the dust particles. Yeah. You can like look right into it. Dang. Nice and bright. Okay. Uh, let's keep. I bet everybody wants to see us, all the trucks we're going to bring in. So I might as well, let's just open up all these doors. The doors are really cool how they open too. I'd never seen that before. Yeah, they open like sideways instead of going up and down. And then we got a bunch of shop tools, stuff that we can, uh, you know, kind of work on the trucks, keep them in tip top shape. We do all maintenance, you know, washes, oil changes, all stuff like that. Then yeah, we got to keep all our equipment where it should be. You guys, let us know in the comment section and thoughts on this map. Like, I gotta say, it might be my favorite map so far in FS22. And in today's video, you know what, Garrett, we'll, we'll show them at the end of the video. We're going to show you guys the hospital and the police station, just to give you a look of it, and maybe a flyover of the city. But it's huge. Is it a 4X map, Garrett? It is definitely a 4X map. Okay, yeah, it's big. There's a big interstate. Oh, we forgot this story. A big interstate, too. Anyway, lots of videos coming out on it. You guys will see it. Let's go get some more trucks, Garrett. Let's do it.
All right, I'm going to get in the special operations unit, the heavy rescue and recovery. This literally has every single tool we would ever need in it. So that's why a lot of times, like if we got a, if there's a big accident or a car pile up, this thing's on duty. Yeah, and it even has a winch. So if we ever have to get someone unstuck or we're stuck, then it comes in handy. Yeah, I, I, go ahead. I'm blocking this guy for you. And we're rolling out. So that's the ambulance we're going to be running. It's pretty cool. It's a little older, but hey, you got to do what you can. We'll keep it in good shape. Yeah, and guys, we're looking to get more fire trucks and everything. If you guys see any good mods for that out there, let us know in the comments because we'll definitely add them to the series. Heck yeah, and then we'll be fighting fires. But here's here's more of the city. It is a little, it, it's just like a huge city. So it feels really realistic like once you're in it. You don't really know where you're at. We aren't used to it yet, but we'll show you the hospital, the police station, and a few other really cool things about the map later in the video. So make sure to stick, stay tuned and, and stick to the end. Come on, Garrett. Watch out for my hedges. I just planted those. Oh, I just ran them over too. Uh, I was going to say, I was like, I think I cleared them pretty good. I think I planted them a little too close. That might be my bad. All right. I'm thinking I'll put this actually in the farthest bay. Oh, not the best approach. There we go. That's all right. Yeah, the ladder. Uh, yeah, I'm curious. Where do you want the ladder truck? That's going to take up a lot of room. Oh, yeah. Maybe that should go here. Okay, I'll put this like at the end because we have that back door too. Yeah, and we have all this space here. We can always keep stuff outside a little bit too. All right. Ready for the next one? Yep. Garrett, you think I can fit down the road in this big cat? <laughs> I'll be surprised if you can fit out of this parking lot. Oh, it, it's got a really... I mean, it takes a while to swing her around, but the turning radius on... Like, the front wheels can crank very sharp, if that makes sense. But yeah, uh, yeah it, it's long. That, yeah, I'll take the other ladder truck then. All right, follow me. That ladder truck's like half the size of this, but with the big city, we got to have something big like this. Otherwise, you know, things could go bad and we can't... I think this goes like five or six stories, which is pretty good. Yeah, that's honestly mainly going to be used just for like if the hospital has a fire or if someone's like trapped on the floor stuff like that or cat stuck in the tree i guess the cat stuck in the tree is probably your we'll use yours for that yeah or even like just a handle ladder yep for Here sure work there we go Hit the nice brakes. and wide turn yes sir yeah so one thing guys since this is a european map obviously the streets are a lot smaller than we're used to so these are american vehicles and it makes it tricky yeah it that's true i didn't think about that i mean yeah, some of the roads are really tight. This one isn't too bad. I feel like they widened it just because the fire station's here. Yeah, always pulling it. But then this entrance, I was trying to convince them to make it wider because that's really tight right there. Well, it makes you a better driver. That's true. The good point, good point. Okay, how am I, yeah, how am I supposed to back this in without, I guess uh, you can- A lot of luck. You can always go around the back, then pull through. That, that might be easier. That's true. Well, here, see if you can if you can back up in there. There we go. Yeah, I got it. Maybe. Yeah, everything fits in here so well. Oh yeah, yeah. And we still have more vehicles to bring down, but yeah, I think we'll be able to fit it. My favorite vehicle after this one. I'll show you guys. It's the fire chief, uh, like side by side looking thing. There we go. That'll be fun to cruise around in, go off road in when we got a break or when you're done with the shift. Here is our side by side 1000. We got our lifted, some bigger tires and rims. That way you can go really fast down the road if you ever need to. And this is the fire chief. We have a fire extinguisher above our head. And then this could be like traffic control too. So it's got it's got like stay back 50 feet and really nice lights up top, a nice light bar. Do you think my scene lights are bright enough for the night? Yeah, those are good. Those are bright during the day, man. There we go. I'll shut those off. Oh, this thing is so wide that I'm driving. I don't know what I'm going to do if traffic comes here the way. Yeah, it's not that tall, but it yeah, it takes up a lot of room. Should we race? You want to race? Move it or lose uh, it. Oh, we could try racing. Oh, I spun out. Fires. Oh, yeah. Good race, man. Chief is not going to be happy with me there. Very good race. Good job. I'll catch you. Okay, we still got a ways to go, but it, this thing, be careful. You don't want to roll it. Yeah, I don't know if I'm going to be able to fit in our driveway between those hedges. Yeah, we'll see. Oh, it's a, oh, it's a little squirrely. I, I think I hit it. Heck, what did I hit there? There we go. I made it. Perfect. Garrett's in there. Let's see. Will this fit in the bays? That's the true question. I'm not too sure. Gary, you can always follow me and like pull around back here too, I was thinking. Follow you around back? Okay. Yeah, just Look. go around back and then it's super easy to pull in. There we go. There we are. Yeah, this thing fits in pretty good. A little tight. You're going to have to be careful pulling this thing out, but... It works. Perfect. Well, we have a few more vehicles to bring down, but Garrett and I can do that later. Thank you guys for sticking around in the video. We're going to go head to the hospital. Let's do it. Well, here's the hospital. It's nice and blue. It has like the hospital cross on it. All right, Garrett, after you. Show us the way. All right. And looking at the name of this, I wonder if this is a German map. 
thought it was i'm not too sure i'm not too fluent in other languages but but let us know so here's some actual hospital beds like these doors shut and open which is really cool let's see what's in there okay oh that's just an entrance so like it's it's nice because like all these doors are active and you can control them let's show where's the elevators here's the elevator yep right there so this is just main floor Garrett, right, get in here all right come on here we go and then we oh second floor third floor uh Geez, we went all the way to the top. Uh, guys, I, I'm not too sure where Garrett went. I think he's stuck in the elevator or something, but uh, it's okay. We'll, we'll get him later. But there's a helicopter pad up here, and then we'll get in. We'll get back in the... Yeah, yeah, we'll take the elevator back down. See if it opens up for me. Okay, I think Garrett's stuck in there, so it won't open up. Here, let's go through the stairs, and I'll show you one of the floors. All right, so this is kind of what like one of the rooms look like. It's super realistic. It has a really nice, I mean, look at that view. And we have like two hospital beds here and stuff. So that's pretty much what they all look like. And there's more to it. Garrett, I found you, man. Yeah, I was stuck in the elevator, man. Oh, okay, hurry up, man. We got places to be. Let's head to the police station. All right. You or, sure no, no, we no, can no. like take a little break in this? Okay, kitchen? I guess. Yeah, yeah. Go ahead, wash your hands or something. But uh, I, you know what, Garrett? I don't think we're gonna be able to make the police station, man. We'll have to show them in in another time when maybe when we set it up. So you're saying that they should like and subscribe and turn on notifications so they know when that video comes out? That's correct. That sounds like a good plan to me. All right, I'm just going to chill out here. I'll talk to you later, man. All right, talk to you later.